you guys hear about this clubhouse has been valued at one billion dollars one billion how insane is that um i got when did i get i got approved or invited on there when a few months back but i haven't necessarily used it um it's just not you know again i i, I don't really care for some of the topics that get spoken about on there you know men boys and girls relationship stuff first date shit like it's just the nonsense topics again and again and again but it has seemed to re it does resonate with some people i don't know why particularly but it does resonate and now they are valued or they're going to be valued at one billion dollars for the next round of investment which is pretty insane especially when you consider i think they don't even have one million users yet right it's still invite only um it's only available on ios not available on android like i said invite only not even one billion users and they're very valued at one billion i still think there's room for a competitor to come in and just completely crush them or take away a sizable chunk of their uh of their market cap i think um wasn't reported that twitter have done something right they've, they've put out some sort of feature that basically compares to what clubhouse are doing so that could be an avenue you can definitely see somebody like an instagram maybe getting involved and just doing something similar right i can definitely see that being a thing so there is a very short window for them to make a lot of money or to make some sort of impact or it might just end up being one of those apps like snapchat that just ends up capturing a certain segment of the population they don't let go of it and it just keeps running by itself basically do you know what i mean so um yeah update sunday club has confirmed that it's raised a series b round led by andreessen horowitz the race to invest in the social uh, audio clubhouse is on again venture capital firms have approached the startup founders in recent weeks about leading its potential next round of funding at roughly one billion dollar valuation according to four people with knowledge of the app investors have also tried to buy clubhouse shares from existing shareholders as an implied valuation of one billion said one people the figure is 10 times higher than their app's valuation from about eight months ago from a hotly contested investment round before it was even available on apple's app store that is wild a new deal at the billion dollar valuation would be unusual for a social media app at this stage of life and would also reflect a broader increase in the valuation for the past growing privately held tech firms that is wild isn't it pretty pretty impressive to be honest um it doesn't really happen too often in it social media apps launching nowadays and becoming this successful it's pretty um it's a pretty hard sector to kind of break into and make an impact right a social media app with, especially with facebook twitter and instagram just being as dominant as they are so for them to come in with a very i guess it's the it's the niche that they occupy as well isn't it they're a pacific niche they're only appealing to people that want to hear the sound of their own voice in big chat rooms talking about all manner of nonsense so that appeals to a very particular group of people and then you put it behind a you put it behind an exclusivity paywall a passivity wall right people love being in the know and being one of the core kids and then you allow the core kids to talk amongst themselves people on the outside in want to hear what they're saying they beg for invites i think people are selling invites now right i've got i think i've got about four invites i think i can offer out there to people so that's funny people are actually selling their invites to flipping clubhouse but yeah it was a clever tactic to be fair and it worked out brilliantly for them so let's see what happens going forward with the app but like i said i'm interested to see what ends up happening will uh people would you know apps like facebook come in and just buy them out and just completely crush them or will they end up just doing what they're doing on their own and continue to grow as time goes on or will it just end up dying a natural death like other social media apps before it and then that one billion dollar valuation will look like a bit of a um a bit of a false move bit of a false dawn who knows who knows